Welcome to day 11 of Camp Corona, a virtual, imaginary vacation land. Today, as always, we have five activities for you. Number one, find a piece of paper. It could be any kind of paper you can find around your house and fold it into a boat. And then get a pan of water and see if it actually floats. Number two, write five things in your journal that you did yesterday or that you wanted to do or that you didn't do. Like I would write down yesterday, I didn't vacuum the bedroom floor. Maybe tomorrow. Number three, Yesterday, I was thinking of what I could make and I thought, let me try making a crazy quilt because we are living in kind of crazy times. And then I thought you could make something like a crazy quilt at home by making a crazy quilt collage out of paper if you don't have plenty of extra fabric at home. So just take a magazine and rip it up, which is pretty fun to do. And then I would like to have this collage have mainly blue things on it. So I'm gonna look at this magazine and see how many pieces of blue I can come up with in the pages I tore up. And lucky for me, there's a good bit of blue in here. So I would take the different pieces of blue and just like, I, oh look, here's some clouds. That's very nice. Just like I did with a crazy quilt. I take these pieces and then get a piece of paper and arrange the pieces in any kind of crazy design you like. Get some scotch tape or some paste and glue them down. One thing it, it, I can tell you that is easy to do if you don't have any paste at home is get a little bowl, put some flour in it, put some water in it and mix it up. And that will use work for paste. And you can put a piece of paste under each piece in your own paper quasi quilt. Okay. Number four, I think it would be a good thing if you wrote a letter to someone that you're missing while you're at Camp Corona. And number five, this morning, I thought I would make some bread. So I wanna show you what I have so far. This is a bowl with bread in it, and I'm gonna let the bread rise for about 18 hours, and then I'm gonna make it into a loaf and bake it. And tomorrow, I'll show you a taste treat you could make with that fresh baked bread. This is bread called No Need Bread, which I think is a kind of funny name because we do need bread. Anyhow, until tomorrow, make sure you remember to send me what you're doing and happy camping.